Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. We're looking at Bertha Benz, The Journey That Changed Everything. I have a feeling this is going to be pretty epic. This was suggested a couple times. I found this by Gladius Thrax on Discord as the latest one. Very excited for this. This is from Mercedes Benz India. This will be linked in the description down below so you can watch the whole thing uh, uninterrupted. And of course, check them out. Uh, let's see what this is about. Here we go. Whoa, look at that. Oh my god, 1888? Jeez, look at that. A witch! A witch is coming! <laughs> a witch! Oh my god, <laughs> a witch is coming. Okay, let's stop and think real quick. It's the 1880s. Everyone has, you know, horse and carriage or walks, right? It, we t we, I think we take things for granted nowadays. We have so many inventions and conveniences. And, uh, you know, most of us interact with automobiles, with cars and trucks uh, every single day. It is so much ingrained in like every single day of our life. Uh, especially as an American, um, we are very car dependent here, right? Everything is very big and spread out and uh, you need a car here. To think of a time where there's no cars is just, I, I honestly can't even imagine it, uh, which is crazy, right? It's, it's, it's just mind blowing. It's one of those things that you're so used to, you think you've always had, but uh, in reality, in the grand scheme of the world, they're, they're still quite new. <laughs> uh, but to think someone had to invent one and then have the courage to drive it, test it, fix it this is this is very interesting i bet this looked alien to other people though <laughs> i bet they'd be freaked out like where's the horse oh geez hold up <laughs> Dude, that is wild. The first, uh, first breakdown in a car. <laughs> Gotta push it to a safe spot. Stay with your brother. Everyone's giving her weird looks though. That's, uh, <laughs> oh geez. Oh, jeez. Oh, what are we going to? Uh, the tavern? The, the bar? Is the pharmacist in here? The pharmacist. <coughs> I'm looking for 10 liters of Lee groin. You won't get those stains out of that dress. Better buy a new one. It's not for my Jeez. dress. It's for my carriage. Oh. Are you trying to poison your horses? Uh. Do you have 10 liters or not? Horses. Ain't no horses out there, buddy. Got an engine. Now, for real, hats off to Bertha Benz here because think of this time too, unfortunately, right? Like 1800s, you know, I wasn't around, but from what I understand, uh, you know, we look at history, it would take super amount of courage to do something you know so independent as a woman because it was a totally different time you see all the men kind of looking down at her and acting you know like no matter what she says acting like she's she's dumb or doesn't know what she's talking about in reality she's driving a car and no one else even knows what it is it's kind of cool and uh, she knows exactly what she needs She's gonna get it running, isn't she? What in the world? 
<laughs> How did those first cars work? I mean, they're fascinating. Oh, it's like a hand crane. We have it so easy now with push button start, don't we? There she goes. Yeah. Wow. Took Bertha 12 hours to complete the 106 kilometer journey to her parents' house in Forsheim. Sorry, I, I probably said that wrong. Forgive my ignorance. The pharmacy where she bought Ligroin is considered the first gas station in history. Uh, yeah, I guess it would be, right? Oh my God. How wild. She introduced her husband's invention to the world and changed our lives forever. Wow, this is going to be a good video for comments. Uh, any history tidbits uh, surrounding this first car around Bertha Benz, uh, you know, cool anecdotes you want to add, uh, please do so. This was powerful, man. This was like a mini movie. And I feel like I, there might be, I don't know, I'm not a movie buff, like I feel like there should be a movie surrounding her and uh, the first car. How insanely like undescribable amount that changed our world right it's just like unbelievable that was really really cool for real wow and if we look at bertha benz over here and go to wiki for just a quick uh, synopsis she was born in 1849 and lived all the way till 1944 almost 100 years old that's very impressive uh, a German automotive pioneer and inventor she was a business partner and wife of automobile inventor Carl Benz uh, in 1888, she was the first person to drive an internal combustion engine automobile over a long distance, field testing for Ben's patent motor wagon, inventing brake lining and solving several practical issues during a journey of 105 kilometers or 65 miles. In doing so, she brought the patent motor wagon worldwide attention and got the company its first sale. So look at that. The first tester, researcher, uh, and basically, uh, God, I can't think of the right word right now. Finding out what the issues were and how to fix them. There's like a word for that, that um, it's early morning here. I'm not uh, thinking of it, right? But she did all those. Also, the first salesman, right? She had the courage to do a long trip in something that wasn't existing yet. Like this was a brand new thing. And to be fair, you don't even know if it's going to work, right? So she was the first driver, long distance driver, and researcher and salesman for a car was a woman. Absolutely incredible. I bet a lot of people didn't know that, myself included. And uh, we have Bertha and Carl Benz to thank for automobiles that we all take for granted every day. <laughs> it was rear wheel drive, <laughs> ringed steel and solid rubber with a steerable front wheel. So it was only three wheels. Various options were chose to provide for customers, such as seat arrangements and folding top. Wow, that is absolutely mind-blowing, I tell you what. It says, in 1925, Carl Benz wrote the following in his memoirs. Only one person remained with me in a small ship of life when it seemed destined to sink. That was my wife. Bravely and resolutely, she set new the sails of hope. Wow, that is awesome. That is awesome. What a power couple, right? And uh, great strength, love between those two to be able to bring their hard work to the world. Really, really cool. It does say in 2011, a dramatized television movie. So not like a big screen movie, but TV movie about the life of Carl and Bertha Benz was made named uh, Carl and Bertha, which premiered on May 11th, 2011. Um, is that it, by the way? Let's see. Yeah, that's it. Bertha Benz, 1849 to 1944. And there she is. Wow. Beautiful woman, too. Very amazing. Uh, great suggestion. I, that was so cool. Absolutely love learning about big moments like this. Please throw a like on there if you enjoyed it. And, of course, subscribe to be part of this amazing community. Check the link in the description so you can check out this video and check out the rest of their stuff. My name is Ian. You're watching IW Rocker. Until next time, we'll catch you later.